This verdict will change the real estate industry forever. The National Association of Realtors has settled an antitrust lawsuit in the amount of $418 million to be paid over a four-year period. Up until this point, sellers have been the predominant parties paying the entire commission in a real estate transaction. This includes what the buyer's real estate agent had been getting paid. The new ruling will be a huge win for sellers, but not so much for buyers. Listing brokers won't be allowed to make any offers of compensation on the multiple listing service, MLS. This change aims to enhance transparency and protect consumers. Buyers brokers must now disclose their expected commission and the services they provide in written agreements. This ensures clarity for both the buyer and the seller. As a real estate broker for 20 plus years, I think this has been long coming. While I love real estate, the commission structures have always been something I haven't been fond of. Generally speaking, when a seller is asked to pay a 5 to 7% commission, it can have a huge bearing on their net proceeds. This new law taking effect in July of 2024 will help the sellers keep more of their hard-earned equity. The larger question now is will buyers pay to be represented or try to represent themselves? I believe there is a huge benefit in hiring an experienced realtor and time will tell what kind of fees will be charged by both parties and how realtors will change their business methods. I'm happy about the change in the long run. I believe it will give more credibility to realtors with the added transparency and protection of consumers.